This is the equation of an ellipse, and we're going to graph it. So solution. So the center here, uh, you just switch the signs. So it'll be negative 2, 1. So the center, so switch it, switch it. Negative 2, 1. Uh, by the way, you know this is an ellipse because uh, these numbers are different, and there's a plus sign. If these numbers are the same, there's a plus sign, this would be the equation of a circle. All right, in an ellipse, A is always bigger than B, and A is going to be the square root of one of these bottom numbers. So 9 is bigger than 4, so A is equal to the square root of 9, so that's equal to 3. So B is the square root of 4, which is equal to 2. All right, because the bigger number is under the Y, it's going to look like this. The major axis is vertical. It's going to look like an egg like this. If the bigger number was under the X, it would look, it would look like this. So we know that the major axis is vertical because the bigger number is under the y. So major axis is vertical. So what we're going to do next is we're going to plot the center and then we're going to go up and down by a because it's vertical. If the 9 had been here, then we would plot the center and then go left and right by a, right? But it's not. It's here, so we're going to go up and down. All right, let's go ahead and do this graph. So there's the y-axis and there's the x-axis. Okay. Center is negative 2, 1, so you go left 2 and up 1, put a dot. So because the major axis is vertical, we're going to go up and down by 3. So 1, 2, 3, boom, put a dot. 1, 2, 3, boom, put a dot. Then you go left and right by 2. So 1, 2, put a dot. 1, 2, put a dot. So again, from the center, which is negative 2, 1, you go up and down by 3. So 1, 2, 3, and then 1, 2, 3, then left and right by 2. And the reason we go up and down by 3 is because the bigger number is under the y. So we go up and down by a. If the bigger number is under the x, then you go left and right by a. Then you connect the dots and try to make a decent uh, ellipse. And that's it.